There's no doubt uh, that the fastest growing uh, language in, in Canada, non-official language, is uh, Spanish. Um, and that's in part because a lot of Canadian kids learn Spanish as a second or third language in school, uh, but it's also because there's a growing uh, pattern of migration uh, from uh, Hispanic countries. Uh, so I gather that something like 800,000 Canadians claim uh, some degree of proficiency uh, in Spanish. Of course, their Portuguese-speaking cousins are another significant number. Um, and then, of course, we have the large Italian community, of, of whom about, I think, 600,000 uh, have some proficiency in Italian. So, uh, altogether, these, uh, these Latin languages, uh, these Romance languages, are, are growing as a share of, of the linguistic diversity of Canada. And I think we need to take it, that into account. Everyone talks about maybe getting their kids into Mandarin classes, that, that, that Chinese languages are the wave of the, the future in the world economy. I think given our geography, geography given our situation, uh, that Canada needs to spend a whole lot more time uh, focusing on, uh, on, Latin, on Latin America broadly and on the Spanish language and our education system and, uh, and in every other respect. Canada is one of the largest Italian communities in the world outside of Italy and TLN has been uh, central to providing uh, Italian language programming to that important community. But TLN was also very visionary. Uh, its founders were 30 years ago when they saw that there would be in the future a, a, a larger wave of Hispanic migration to Canada. So they created uh, the TLN Hispanic programming which and you know their vision now proves to have been very prophetic because uh, we now see Spanish as the fastest growing language group in, in Canada, so a uh, non-official language. So um, I believe that in the future, TLN will be providing the same kind of important service to the Hispanic community that it has historically done for the Italian community, and in both respects, uh, serving and helping to make real Canada's vision of multiculturalism.